Hey guys, in this video I'm going to do a test fire of uh, my suppressor here. Uh, this is a 300 blackout um, bolt action. Uh, these first three rounds will be um, loaded with 1680. These are 220 grain subsonic bullets. That's the first round. And I'm not wearing ear hearing protection uh, because it's not actually that loud. Um, I'm not exactly sure how the uh, the camera's going to pick it up, but here's the second set one. And then here's number three. And it is pretty quiet. Okay, this is going to be three rounds. Five grains of Trail Boss, which is a pretty fast burning powder. And it is really quiet. I'm going to try to pick up all my brass here. Okay, here comes round number two. And round number three. Now we've got uh, some loads of Winchester 231. I'll put the load data for all these uh, in the description below. And this is a 16 inch barrel. Um, if you don't know, this is my Form 1 suppressor. It's 8 inches long. And um, the microphone is really close to the muzzle here and uh, to the action. So, one more set of three. Okay, this will be the last set of three. This is Vitaveri N320. Uh, this is also another fast burning powder. And here comes the last shot. Um, there we go. So yeah, these are really nice loads and the suppressor works really nicely. And before I put the booster on, you can kind of see inside of it. The, I'm using a whole bunch of clipped cones in there. These are machined baffles. And I'm going to thread the, uh, the booster on here. And we're going to run a few different kinds of subsonic ammunition. Uh, first up will be 124 grain. Um, and then we'll do 147 and 165 at the end. Um, there'll be three of each and for the very last shot I will hold the uh, I'll hold the action closed which is a little tricky to do but uh, then you'll get a get a feel for um, how quiet it is without the action and these will be kind of slow this will be kind of slow fire because um, I uh, try and pick up all my brass so here's uh, let's do the first shot here And I'm not wearing any ear protection, and the um, the camera is awfully close. The, uh, the microphone is awfully close to the action here. Let's two. Let's do one more of the 124 grain. Try and look through the sights and get the get the the can in the picture here. Okay, these will be 147s up next. So there's a little bit louder. The bolt's moving considerably faster for, for these 147s. I think the um, 124s I have going at 850 and these are 1050. Okay, last one of the 147s. Okay, next three should be with the 165s. Number two of the 165s. And from my perspective, uh, it's not loud at all. It is uh, mostly a clacking from the action here. Uh, this should be number three for 165. And on this one, I'm gonna take the action, I'm gonna hold it closed and try to aim with the front sight here, something reasonable. And so there you could hear the bullet impact last round. I'm gonna hold the, the I'm gonna hold this right next to the uh, the microphone the same distance here. That is the slide closing and this is dry fire. Okay there we go. Hey guys we're back in the shop after that test fire. The pistol I use is a SIG 226 
the rifle, the bolt action rifle that I used is a Ruger American in 300 blackout. Um, I've reviewed the video briefly and it appears that, uh, or rather it sounds that, it captured the audio pretty good um, as far as the sound level of the, of the gunshot report. Um, I tried to talk while I was firing so that the microphone wouldn't have a chance to try and adjust uh, to attenuate the gunshots and to try to amplify uh, when it was quieter. Uh, seemed to work pretty well. Um, so yeah, um, if you want one of these, uh, if you want to make one of these, um, I've got a bigger one right here. Um, this is also an 8 inch, but it's much bigger volume. If you want to make one, um, look at my video. I'm going to put a link uh, right here. Click on the suppressor. I'll put a link um, where you can do your paperwork. Uh, you pay your 200 bucks and you'll wait somewhere between three months and more and then uh, you'll get your stamp back and by that time I'll have my other videos done and I'll show you how to make uh, all the internals to this. Uh, there's mul multiple ways to do it. The freeze plug way is kind of the simplest. Uh, it doesn't sound nearly as good as this but it still works. Um, if you're shooting at steel the report is still uh, quieter than the bullet hitting the steel. If you shoot paper or you just want to go for the ultimate suppression. Uh, these milled baffles are really, really quiet. Um, uh, you, there's uh, in no way do you need any hearing protection for these two rounds. Uh, if you shoot supersonic, then it's probably a good idea. But uh, yeah, so um, fill out your paperwork, uh, make your trust, uh, submit your Form 1, pay your 200 bucks, get in line, and um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.